What's up? I'm Staff Sergeant Dennis Marsley, and I'm here to talk to you a little bit about recycling on Fort Drum. With thousands of people living and working on Fort Drum, it goes without saying that we generate a lot of trash. Whether you work in office space or the motor pool, we all generate a lot of waste. The Army is committed to recycling, and we all have to do our part. As of right now, approximately 80% of the trash thrown away on Fort Drum can and should be recycled. One of the most commonly thrown away items is plastic bottles. On average, Americans use 200 per year and only recycle about 40 of them. What most people don't know is that the trash coming from Fort Drum is checked for recyclables. If we exceed the allowable limit, we have to pay double to dispose of that trash. So why do we throw so many recyclables in the trash? Sometimes we're just busy, sometimes we're just being lazy. But even if it's one post-it note or one plastic bottle, if thousands of people are throwing it in the trash, it's going to add up quickly. Sometimes people just don't know what can be recycled. Here on Fort Drum, we use single stream recycling. That means everything goes in the same bin. Recyclable items include plastics, except for plastic bags, which should be placed in the trash, glass containers, cardboard, bottles, metal and aluminum cans, and paper products such as newspaper, magazines, computer paper, paper plates, and white or colored paper. Shredded paper, which is not recyclable, should be thrown in the trash. Come here, private. Some people may not know, especially those new to Fort Drum, that New York State has a deposit on items such as soda and beer. When you buy these products, you pay a deposit of five cents per can or bottle. You can take returnable bottles and cans to a redemption center and be reimbursed, or you can place them in a bin with the rest of your recycling. So why should you recycle? Well first, it's the law. Army regulation and New York State law require everyone to recycle. Recycling saves the Army money, and what you might not know is it can also generate funds for the installation. Some of the material collected here on Fort Drum is sold to outside organizations. This money that we receive for the materials can be used for programs such as better opportunities for single soldiers, to pay for welcome home ceremonies and special events, or to buy gym equipment. Recycling saves valuable natural resources and is just part of being a good steward of our environment. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you saw, make sure you give us a thumbs up. Check the description box below for more links. And subscribe to our channel to learn more about all things Fort Drum.